Hello, good morning. My name is Gary Britland. I'm in Also Twistle, Lancashire, and uh, this place is uh, called the Printer's Arms. It was a licensed premises in 1840, and uh, it was owned by uh, James Simpson, the first, and he was a calico printer, a block printer, and he owned the Foxhill Bank Print Works. He was born in 1766 in Mervyn, Perthshire, Scotland, and he was uh, married to Elizabeth Burry. Uh, the Burry family who owned lots of land and did a lot of calico printing in the early, early period. Uh, we married her in 1799. The Burry family was a local property owners. Uh, they owned lots of mills. Uh, and in 1813, Foxhill Print Bank Print Works was leased to Mr. James Simpson. Uh, and he made his wealth, he was a very wealthy man. Uh, out to design in uh, a diamond print uh, and then he bought this premises and uh, stayed here with Mrs Elizabeth Burry but then uh, later in 1840 it was a licensed premises to be a pub uh, but it's looking a bit of a sorry state at the moment and needs reviving uh, I've known it to be a public house for a long time um, but it does look a bit of a mess uh, and James the first uh, had a nephew who was called Thomas Simpson and he had the Aspen Valley uh, the coal um, colliery in 1860 18, 1868 uh, and uh, James Simpson the first left uh, an inheritance of a hundred and ten thousand pound when he died in 1851 uh, now his son uh, was also quite wealthy because he inherited that as well uh, but his son didn't want to get into calico printing uh, and he was the first vegetarian president um, and they both buried, the father and son are buried at Church Kirk graveyard it's a massive tomb that they have there uh, Thomas Simpson carried on uh, with the coal mining and uh, Foxhill Bank Print Works which is just down the road which I'm going to tell you about soon uh, but the Simpson family were very wealthy um, and um, the company that took over uh, Aspen Valley was called Simpson Rostron and Company um, and it was run by Thomas Simpson and J.S. Young uh, so they were the people there uh, but also they had uh, the Foxhill Bank Printworks, which was a massive site just down the road. Thank you.